Libra, this is Nick. I hope that everybody is doing well, you guys. I came to bring you guys some energy. Um, you guys, um, we're going to jump right in. Um, I have a situation to where as somebody is either married um, or a higher connection here, okay? Um, there has been third-party situations. Um, somebody is definitely going through some type of heartbreak right now and is definitely cutting the situation out, okay? Somebody has been using um, a lot of patience in moderation, okay? Um, but they're losing patience. They're losing patience because this person keeps coming around saying they're sorry. This person keeps coming around trying to um, make it seem like, you know, um, they made a horrible mistake and, you know, um, they, they want the reunion, they want a reunion here. Okay. But the problem is they're still flirtatious as hell. Okay. Queen of swords are in you guys' energy Libra. This is you. Okay. Or you're dealing with the Libra, um, Aquarius or Gemini. Um, others are here as well. Okay. We got Taurus. We got, um, definitely, definitely could possibly be a marriage. Cause I definitely do have a counterpart here, but we also have Sagittarius as well. Okay. Um, but listen, the Queen of Swords is getting to the truth of this matter, okay? This person is being very strong, okay? Being very direct, okay? Protective, um, independent, um, principled, open-minded, uh, wants honesty, very constructive and direct, okay? And the reason why is because there's a problem that needs to be solved, okay? A judgment shot has to be called. Somebody has uh, either in problems with the legal, for some of you, it's going to be some type of legal, <coughs> excuse me, ruling that's going to happen, or somebody is going to call the shot based on uh, what Queen of Swords finds out, okay? Um, and definitely will be making a judgment. This could be a, this could be a, um, a, um, a reunion um, of forgiveness. This could be forgiving, or this could actually be a change of status, okay? Um, it's taken a while for this to happen, though, okay? For Queen of Swords to find out all well, Queen of Swords needs to find out in order to make her decision, all right? So with this love, with this marriage, with this higher connection, baby mama, baby daddy, okay? Listen, something happened. There was a breakup here, some type of separation, grief, heartbreak behind this. Either somebody cheated on somebody or put somebody in front or over somebody else, okay? Like family members, friends, something to that degree, okay? Um... There's been disillusion. There's been betrayal here. Um, a lot of upheaval. There's a lot of sadness here. Sorrow, trauma, depression. Somebody's not handling this well. Either you or your person, okay? Or cross watcher, all right? Uh, puzzle pieces, you guys. Anytime you guys get a general read from me, it is always puzzle pieces, okay? Um, and cross watcher energy can, will get involved in this. Cross watcher, I want you guys to know that you are more than welcome to watch Libra's video and you are more than welcome to watch any one of my videos. If this is a Libra that has done this to you, please go in the comment section below. Let me know. Um, I'm very interested and how energy interchanges in between signs within my reads okay so uh, you guys are very much so welcome uh please like share and subscribe cross watcher okay somebody got cut off all right it's just that simple somebody is in trouble here okay somebody does have law issues all right uh, i don't know what kind of trouble it could be a traffic ticket murder one i don't know okay domestic violence something to that degree okay but for some of you this is damn sure the case Somebody is dealing with somebody who is very manipulative, okay? Um, somebody is using logic. Um, somebody is analyzing this situation. Um, somebody is becoming very detached, okay? Um, there is no structure here, okay? It's all over the place. Emotions are all over the place, okay? There's a power struggle here for some of you guys. Some of you guys are being very strict and have blocked this person, using a lot of self-discipline, even when maybe somebody does really want to talk about this, okay? It's almost like, you know what, I might want to talk about it, but you know what, it really just doesn't even really matter, okay, what comes out. That's going to be for some of you. Um, for others of you, um, somebody is definitely waiting, okay? Um, somebody wants serenity. Somebody wants tranquility. They're moderating, mitigating um, uh, the situation. And moderation, contentment, calm, peace, having patience. They want to balance it. They want to balance the situation out, okay? They're, they're using a lot, a lot of self-discipline, okay? But the problem is, is that somebody is losing this patience, Reason why they're losing this patience, Libra, cross watcher, um, and, and becoming, um, you know, um, impatient is because somebody is, is really 
fast moving here. Somebody is is, is really impulsive here. Somebody is ing aggressive, um, you know, maybe too self-assured, overly self-assured, inflated ego. Uh, like I said, um, they're very confident, okay? And what they're confident in, you guys, is the fact that they feel like they can run some game, all right? They feel like, you know, they made a mistake, okay, which they didn't make a mistake, okay? When you cheat on somebody, that is not a mistake. That is a choice, okay? What they did was they made a bad decision if this is the way that they feel, okay? Um, but, you know, they're really trying to dismiss this behavior as something that is very nonchalant, as something that is not important. I didn't care about the person. It just happened. I was drunk. I was high. I was whatever, okay? It's, they came on to me. You know, that old type stuff, okay? And they're basically saying, for some of you, I'm sorry. They're basically saying this. Problem, reason why somebody is losing patience is because somebody is like, you know what? You're full of games, okay? I'm tired of you playing with me, all right? And, um, you know, you, the, you, you're, you're too flirtatious, okay? You're all over the place with everybody, okay? Um, you know, you, you show a lot of interest in things that, you know, really is not conducive to our relationship. You see what I'm saying? Um, and this person is, 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 is very aggressive and obsessive. They won't let it go, even though somebody made a mistake. I don't know if you're the one that stepped wrong or this is your person or cross watcher. I have no idea. Okay. Um, we are going to clarify Libra day one. So love you guys. Thank you so much for still being here with me. Um, I know I have put you, um, you Aquarius and Gemini in the collective. So I'll be doing more collective reads for you guys, but I will be popping up at least, you know, once a week for you guys. Okay. Um, as far as the Libra read. All right. Um, you guys, um, the ones that are new and recent to the channel, you guys, thank you so much for accepting my invitation to subscribe. You guys, you guys have done nothing but help this channel grow. And for that, I am very appreciative. I'm happy that you're here. You guys go in the comment section. Let me know that you guys are new to the channel so that I can give you a warm welcome to the channel myself. I love to do that. Okay. Uh, for the ones that have not subscribed, please accept my invitation to subscribe. There are so many things that are going on on this channel. Um, for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read. I will find you. Okay. Um, my mystery ground are very fun but they're very random um and then they, that's when i just pick up a handful of people and at the middle of the night and just say you gotta you know 15 minutes to contact me and i'm giving stuff away Ship, shipping is free okay um as far as my monthly winners go um there is somebody that will be selected every month the beginning of the month on the community page you guys check that community page that's your notification bells okay um because i do announce it there all right um you guys um if you guys are interested in any of my personal reads or any of my plans or items please check the description box you guys will find my reads my pricing and the description of them you will also find my email in there okay if any of one of you guys are going through a heartbreak or anything like that please check out my website i have wrote articles about that um, my latest one is is healing from a heartbreak okay and that might be a good read for you um that will be at hrhnikitero.com hrhnikitero.com and that information is also in my website okay you guys we are a little bit over a year okay um i am for every ten thousand subscribers you guys i will be giving amazing gifts away okay so uh, this one right here is for the 10k that is coming up okay we're going to be hitting it very shortly here okay this is a louis vuitton pouch purse charm bag okay it goes on to you guys's bags or your key ring all right females y'all know all about this okay um this is um very cute it is a puppy um it is monogrammed it is authentic it has serial number it comes with this a pa original packaging and then the booklets and everything else that it comes with okay um you can put this on your purse or your keychain um i have a lot of these you guys i wear them on bags all the time i'm sprung on them but um i don't have a puppy but i am giving the puppy away it also has this little coin pouch thing that you know you can put your money credit cards um extra cash whatever okay in there okay lip gloss whatever okay if you are a dude and you do not like the cute little puppy to put on the side of your key ring or on your belt buckle or whatever give it to your wife give it to your girlfriend okay mother or something like that she will absolutely positively love it okay you guys i have uh prayed over these uh clarifiers all right in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit i have asked for truth revelation confirmation guidance consolation peace protection as i give jesus christ all the praise the honor and the glory so this is what we're expecting in this read you guys we're expecting truth okay somebody did cheat okay somebody cheated this is a marriage 
If this is not a marriage, this is a higher connection. This is a baby mama, baby daddy, okay? Somebody is losing patience, all right? Somebody is hurt and somebody had to cut somebody off. Somebody definitely is in legal problems and it is taking a while for somebody to really make the decision if somebody wants to, um, you know, to take this person back, okay? Um, with this here page of swords, okay, with this person, listen, how somebody probably found out about this is through some type of gossiping. Somebody spied on somebody or somebody is spying on somebody at this point in the game. Somebody is checking out somebody's um, social media, going over text messages, looking at your pictures, um, you know, um, gossiping. Um, they could even be lying, okay? Um, this person is very curious about what you got going on right now or about vice versa. This person is rebellious when it comes down to somebody's privacy. They have no, um, they have no respect for somebody's privacy at this point. Okay. They need to know what's going on. I, like I said, I feel like somebody wants a reunion here. Um, but there's a lot of mental agility here. They definitely want a reunion. Okay. They want, a, um, they want a, um, a, um, they want victory. Okay. With you. All right. Or you with them. Okay. They want success in this relationship, but this three of swords here, um, has caused somebody damn sure to fall back. This has been very toxic energy here, okay? Um, this separation, this grief, this heartbreak, betrayal, um, disillusion, upheaval, sadness, sorrow, trauma, depression, okay? It's riddled with restrictions, temptations, third-party situations, bondage, manipulation, materialism, addictions, okay? Somebody had to fall back here, you guys. Um, <clears throat> somebody had to go into solitude. Somebody may be feeling lonely right now, full of anxiety, okay? Uh, grieving the death of this relationship, okay? Or even the death of trust, okay? Um, fearful, okay, for some of you, needing to definitely rest and recuperate. I'm definitely thinking about things with introspection, a lot of it very overwhelmed self-protection and definitely retreating okay because of this devil okay this devil i mean this is drug addictions this is sex addictions this is you know third party situations this is narcissism restrictions temptation manipulation materialism and like i said addictions of all kind of sort you know and it's almost like you know for somebody to have somebody in this, somebody is losing strength, okay? Somebody is using mind over matter. They're becoming self-aware. Their, their, their strength is coming back dealing with this person or dealing with this energy that this person has brought to them, okay? Um, this person is very overbearing, okay? So it's taken somebody a lot of courage and a lot of self-love to be able to um, get over this, okay? Um, nonetheless, somebody will be in a fearless mindset, okay? Got everything to do with a lot of drinking, a lot of third-party situations. Could be threesomes, okay? Social groups, celebrations, parties. Something may have happened at a party, a celebration, um, some type of gathering, okay? Um, family and friends may have something to do with this, okay? Something's definitely going to change. This right here was a life lesson, okay? Um, this was very unexpected, this third party situation or whatever somebody found out, this grief, this anxiety, um, this uh, negativity, um, but nonetheless, this was fate and something definitely did have to change here because this person is showing up as toxic, okay? King of Swords is here and you guys' is energy and, um, you know, this person is manipulative. Somebody is very much so analyzing this, okay? Um, analyzing the fact I got another person showing up here. I got another person showing up here. Okay. And listen, the people, the third party situations here possibly could have been, okay. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay. Um, somebody romanced the hell out of this, uh, these people. Okay. They took them out. They spent money on them. Okay. Um, they may have sold them dreams. They may have even told these people that they love them, okay? But they definitely dated these individuals, okay? So somebody is definitely cutting somebody out here. Somebody is a serial cheater. Somebody, it feels like somebody has a drug addiction, alcohol addiction, and a sex addiction to me, all right? They're very manipulative. They're not forthcoming. They're not taking accountability. They're not doing any of those things. They may even be blame shifting. I'm feeling a little bit of narcissism as well here with the gaslighting, okay? Because somebody already knew that somebody was doing something that they didn't have any business doing puzzle pieces you guys remember anytime you guys get a general read from me is puzzle pieces okay listen with this king of swords energy here somebody definitely is using um a lot of strength to um to stay away from this person and to also cut them off okay but i want to know about this uh, these other people who you know they indulged in okay <coughs> excuse me 
somebody could have been married here. Um, somebody could have went back to their ex. Somebody could have um, tried to work something out with an ex. Somebody may have slept with an ex, okay? Somebody, um, an ex may have came after them, all right? Um, but nonetheless, you know, this is a person that they did love and possibly have children by, you guys. Um, if this person was married before, um, then this is another individual who they dealt with, okay? Um, if they weren't married before, then they damn sure did sell them dreams. They damn sure did make them feel as though, you know, that this was going, this romance and this, um, dating and attraction was definitely going to lead to some type of, uh, marriage or higher connection, higher commitment. Okay. But this right here, because you found out about this or because this has come to the light in some type of way, shape, fashion, or form, listen, this right here has come to an end. Okay. This relationship is over. Um, it, you know, it's a possibility somebody may mend this, but as far as right now, it got cut off. It's just that simple. Right. Somebody is losing patience because they're wounded, set back and guarded. They're tired of somebody becoming aggressive. They're tired of their energy is being drained. Somebody is becoming too persistent on somebody. When somebody knows the truth, they're sitting up here talking about they're sorry. They're sitting up here talking about they made a mistake. Okay. Like I said, it wasn't a mistake. It was a bad choice. Okay. But it was an ongoing choice. This is not just one time Libra, a cross watcher. Okay. Somebody knows that this person is, um, you know, very, very flirtatious. Okay. And this aggression, this seizing the moment, this being focused on somebody and it's took, it's confident to the point to where they feel like maybe they have somebody wrapped around their fingers. Okay. Like maybe they can do this. All right. But nonetheless, this is very um, self-impulsive. This person may call you in the middle of the night, okay? Um, what they want to do is they want you to continue to invest in them. They want you to continue to um, give to this connection. They want you to be understanding about, you know, um, or vice versa, um, about these other people. You know what I'm saying? Um, they're dealing with delayed success, and they're not, they don't like that, all right? They're, things are not happening. Excuse me, guys. Things are not happening in this relationship the way they want it to happen. It's going in the opposite direction, okay? Um, they want growth here, okay? I don't know how they want growth, but they over here being toxic, but they do, okay? They want th th things to cultivate. They want, um, you know, they want to overcome this, dif this th these difficulties, and they want you to continue to invest into this relationship, all right? So, you know, I don't, you know, I don't know because, you know, you do got judgment here. I mean, that, that, that is a second chance around, you know what I'm saying? So, but look, you know, death is here. All right. It's game over life changing, new beginnings, endings. Okay. And transformations. Okay. So I don't see where somebody is going to continue to invest in this, this nine, of, this page of cups, you know, this is immature energy. Somebody's a little bit younger than somebody here. They feel like they can say what they want to say and you're supposed to believe it. And just because they give a, a, a apology and just because they're sitting up here crying and begging on the phone or in your face, they feel like, you know, you're supposed to have some type of remorse. You're supposed to have some type of um, mercy towards them, even though they're the ones that are the fouls. They keep doing the fouls. They're the perpetrator in this, but they keep acting like they're the victim. Okay. Somebody is guilty. Somebody does feel lost. Somebody does feel abandoned. Okay, somebody definitely is in despair, okay, in grief, all right? Um, but this was unnecessary. This is just because somebody couldn't stay home. They couldn't, you know, um, they couldn't stop seeing people. They couldn't stop cheating. So during this process, somebody damn sure went into hermit mode, okay? Virgo is now here. Um, somebody thought about their ascension. Somebody started doing soul searching, self-reflection, introspection, wisdom, solitude, self-care, and inner guidance, okay? Somebody is a serial ass cheater here, okay? Libra, this could be you, all right? And somebody is showing up as toxic. Just like I said, somebody is a serial cheater here, okay? This is either you or your person, okay? Adventurous, in and out, taking risks, flirtatious, charming, free-spirited, rebellious, intense, inconsistent, swift speed, not really listening to anybody, okay, but their self. This is instant gratification, especially with this knight of swords, okay? Um, this is something that, you know, hey, this this has made somebody feel less than who they are, too. This is really a temper with somebody's um, self-esteem as well. They're not feeling like the person who they usually feel, okay? They feel let down. They feel like, 
if I really meant all what I was supposed that I thought that I meant to you, you would not have done this to me. So therefore, I probably am not what you told me that I was to you. Somebody feels upside down. Somebody feels um, not worthy. Okay, maybe their self esteem is being affected. Queen of Swords. Their self um, self esteem is being affected. Maybe they're full of self doubt. Maybe they're blaming their self. Justice is here, you guys. So somebody definitely does have legal problems here. But when it comes down to Queen of Swords and getting to the truth of the matter, she will. He or she will. Okay, there will be some type of karmic justice. There will be some type of justice. This person will find out more truth. Okay, and there will be a legal ruling for the people that are in trouble. And there will be a ruling and a judgment call from this person who is the victim in this situation. Okay. Um, and this right here is not, it's going to be with no mercy. It's not that they don't care, but they're, they're really being strict. Okay. It's like they're holding their, themselves back in order to execute this justice and this judgment. Okay. Yeah. Because they, they're awakened. They're awakened to whatever the hell is going on. What they're awakened to this toxicity. They're awakened to this, um, you know, to all of these people here, okay, and to all of this in different energies that are coming against this union, okay, they are no longer blinded to the truth, okay, they're stepping into their energy, they are no longer allow, allowing themselves to be in a self-imposed prison or any other kind of prison, they're not going to be gaslighting, gaslit anymore, they're tired of being in anxiety, somebody's been in anxiety, they're tired of being in fear, they've been in fear, helpless, feeling trapped, powerless, victim, victimized, restrictions, they're tired of that, they don't want to do that anymore, they're about to call judgment on this, okay, this is all because of love, you guys, you guys are friends, all right, whoever this is for, cross watch or you, it could have been a marriage, but this was supposed to be a sacred union, and this is supposed to be love, somebody was very committed to this person who cheated a lot, okay, Somebody is definitely leaving. Somebody is going to go get their dreams, okay? Um, they're going to go hard, work hard and it's going to pay off, okay? They're going to explore. We got travel here, okay? They're moving forward and they're patiently waiting for the right time to make that move, okay? It has taken a long time for them to get to this point with this Knight of Pentacles, okay? But, you know, once they get to this point here with this Knight of Pentacles... Um, I don't, I think they'll be very, um, ambitious. Okay. And persistent. Okay. They're very practical. They're not emotional. You guys, when it comes down to this, not when they get to this point here. Okay. They're going to be making the move. It's just that simple. Okay. And the move to leave the move to catch out. All right. Told you it's been a long time coming because it was a lot of mental anguish that they had to go through. There was indecision here. There was information overload. Um, there was denial. Okay. They didn't want to believe the truth. There was emotional block. There was waiting it out. There was insecurity here. Um, there was difficult choice and rigidness. Okay. And listen, you guys hit the tower. Okay. Something it, love blew up in your face. All right. And it got everything to do with this manipulation. All right. And this game plan, this toxicity, these lies, these alibis, sudden event, change, chaos, Sudden change, destruction, negativity, up, love blowing up in your face, okay? Somebody's face. And it's all because of this devil. And it's all because of these third parties. And what this devil has done has caused nothing but separation and grief, okay? Yeah, because they had nothing but options. And they damn sure did indulge in each one of them, okay? And let me tell you something. These options, they lost a good one, okay? Because nothing, nothing panned out with the rest of these people at all. Give me these people down here, Holy Spirit. I got so many people that somebody didn't fuck with, all right? For real, for real, all right? I got everybody, okay? I got um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I got uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I got Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I got Taurus, Aries. I got um, uh, Cap, uh, um, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio, okay? So tell me about, tell me about Queen of Cups. Again, because I told you they, they went through hangman mode, okay? It's not anything that is, you know, this person gave to this person. This person gave money to this person, all right? But they ended up in hangman mode, okay? They ended up in limbo, in suspension. Nothing shook, okay? However, it felt like somebody needed some help, and they went, same, your person, you helped them out, and that was it. Listen, this when, when it comes down to this um, Leo Sagittarius Aries or vice versa, you guys, okay? Put it where it goes, okay? Um, this person just absolutely positively just, just did not want them anymore. It just, it was about money with them as well, okay? It was about this person putting somebody on to be successful, okay? Materialistic is here, okay? 
um when it comes down to this king of cups it's cancer pisces scorpio my cards is upside down somebody did want a reunion okay somebody thought that this person was the right one okay this cancer pisces scorpio okay or the rest of them all right and and then with the other one we got the juggling we got the mixed messages okay we got profit and loss. It looks like your person or you have spent a lot of money on these people who these third parties have been about, okay? Nonetheless, somebody is tiptoeing out the door. Nonetheless, somebody is getting to the truth of the matter. Somebody knows better. Game is over. Death is here, okay? There's been a lot of betrayal. There's been a lot of third party situations. And um, there has been a lot of dreams being sold, okay? And somebody is just absolutely positively devastated behind this, okay? They're hurting. They're crying. Um, they're grief-stricken, but they also have a lot of self-discipline. They're like, you know what? Yes, I feel all these type of ways. But you know what? One thing it is is that you do not deserve me. And no matter how much I love you, I and, and I do, okay? Um, I'm not going to be able to do this. All right. So this is what I have for you, Libra. I hope that I was able to put one piece together for you. If I was, then I definitely did my job and I would appreciate it if you guys like, share and subscribe. I will see you guys soon.